Okay, so deepening theme. Two minutes with Linda Seeger, just giving you a flavor. We're not saying any of these people are smarter than anyone else. They're just different and work for different people. She wrote the classic, making a good script great, which the key thing there is after your script is done, it's not good. It's not great, even if it's good. Themes. What's the meaning of life? Or we might say, what's the meaning of your story? It doesn't matter what kind of story you tell or what genre it is. It doesn't matter if it's horror or sci-fi or drama or comedy or magical realism. You still need to have a central idea in your story. And the central idea is generally something about the human condition. What does it mean to be human? What are you saying about humanity through the story that you're telling? What is your story about? Is this a story about integrity, greed, finding your identity, corruption, manipulation? Whatever it is, if you can find that one word, it begins to help you focus on what your story is about. Then you can begin to put that word into a phrase that has a verb in it. Remember that drama is about action. It's about process. It's about people doing things, finding and discovering. Movies are about images, about cinematic images. So as a writer, you are training your ability to see visually so that you can describe in the script the visual. What are we looking at? What is the audience going to be seeing on the screen? But the visuals that you see have to be carefully chosen. And the images are not just description. They go beyond it. OK, now quick. Um uh, Bob McKee was going to make his uh, point. How do writers unearth? How many of you guys are at that point where you're just, you're not sh sure, you don't know what story you want to tell yet, but you're trying to unearth it? How, in the, in how do you unearth it? This goes back to the, that tap, this is where tapping into these non-traditional things that have to do with the story page, you know, plot point ones and before you get to midpoints, what are these archetypal energies that you're trying to, to express in the, and that will end up taking the form of character? And these are bubbling under in your unconscious and that's where the, you know, on the Writer's Journey playlist you'll see uh, lots of books, everything where we go from Freud to Jung to Joseph Campbell. Uh, that question is so generalized. Um, unearth the stories that want to be told. Um, I think all of that unearthing goes on inside of you. It's not as if out there in the world there are stories actually buried in, in society, buried in, in the ground of life. Uh, that um, in some animated way want to, um, want to come up out of their graves and tell themselves. Uh, the, the stories that want to be told are in you. You are responding to your life and to the, your own inner life. And if you have talent, um, there are certain stories that might be inspired by something you see on the street, uh, a dream you have one night, it's very common, um, a, something you read in a, in a newspaper, uh, something sparks the, um, the, the genius and the talent of the writer. Uh, characters begin to materialize and story gets to be told. And, and it, there's, in that sense, uh, that it comes from within you, there, um, there's an old um, expression in writing that, that I believe in, that in a very real way, uh, the stories are already written in you. Your problem as a writer is to get out of their way. Um, this, 
there, there are people who will argue about the degree to which things are conscious and unconscious, but I think it's, um, it's useful uh, to imagine that your unconscious mind, if you are talented, of course, the unconscious mind of a talented person uh, has already created stories that are living inside of the writer. The writer then these has to be inspired. These stories then find their way out of the writer and into the writer's uh, work. And that in a very real way, stories want to be told, uh, but they, um, the stories are already in the, 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 the mind of a talented writer. Uh, and, um, and the writer's job then is to, to somehow let these stories come to life.